Stack going with Jigglypuff, one of his better characters. Yeah, he definitely feels comfortable with this character. Um, but then so, so does Bok Choy. Um, I have not seen these two play in quite a while. So I'm not sure as to how this could go. It's off to a slow start, everyone. Yeah, just... these are floaty characters. Um, neither of them really have much of a combo game, so this is probably going to be a pretty slow set. I think oh, that's God. where uh, Bok Choy has an advantage playing a little slower. But something was on fire, but it was just someone baiting. Still allow that in here? Uh, I guess. I think the advantage goes to Bok Choy just for the projectiles. Mm -hmm. He's got a little bit more to his arsenal. Yeah. Oof. Throws that key right into the stage. I think he wanted to just peek it over the edge. There's one of the multitude of recoveries Pac-Man has. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Jigglypuff able to go off stage and edge guard Pac-Man. One of the few characters who can who can comfortably do that. Ooh, looking for that air dodge. It's one of the things that Bok Choy likes to do. He's drop that trampoline. Ooh, he air dodged right at the blast zone. Nice setup. Just dances around with those projectiles. Stacked at 124%. These yeah, floaty characters. Pretty high for Jigglypuff. Like oh, he Ooh, catches he... the bell. Oh, but doesn't. Oh, doesn't make Not anything able with to it. Utilize it well. Ooh, and he misses the forward smash. That could have been big for Stacked. Fight for the apple there. Yeah, no one got it. Cool. Stacked easily, able to float away from those. Still not gonna kill, 140% on Jigglypuff. No, that's way too high for an up smash. Oh, he wow, Bok Choy just not giving his stock away. Ooh, and that's, he'll be, he'll make a bet. Will and oh, not almost quite. got the kill. Not quite gonna take it. Bet you that orange. Stack just biding his time. Yeah, 161 percent. Kicking on the percent slowly. Oh, oh no! Stage spike. Oh. And he got him. Actually, shakes his head. Wow, a two stop. Two stocks. Um, very, very precise play and stacked. Absolutely. I have not seen him play it in quite a while. Mm -hmm. He hasn't been in any of the uh, weeklies. If he does, he comes and plays Melee. Mm -hmm. And then uh, shows up here and just puts on a great show. Yeah. Takes a, takes a game off our PR. Or one of our PRs. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, if, if he plays how he did first game, it, it'll take the set. Bok Choi's got to change something. Definitely not happy oh, the slow his, walk. Uh, oh. oh, good start for Bok Choy. It's coming out a little more offensive. It might work for him, it might work yeah. against him. We'll see. Yeah. Ooh. Now, one thing you don't see stacked going for a lot is rests. I think that's really, really smart in this situation because Pac-Man's not standing still very much. Um, it, it, I, I think it, it's pretty hard to set up rests, especially on someone who's moving so much. So he's not focusing on trying to get the rests. He's just focusing on, on getting him off stage, going to the edge guard, putting on that percent. Um, and Octoy just doesn't really have an answer. One of the things Stacked is really good at is floating around, being in the right place at the right time. He's one of those 
players, it's able to just stall the Jigglypuff right in the air. Mm -hmm. Oh. And just wait for you. Like we saw there. Try there, to the wow. Spike. So, so good from Stack, knowing that Bok Choi is going to come over onto the stage, setting up the spacing, and being ready with that F-Smash. Stack just not falling for any of the shenanigans Pac-Man's thrown out. Yeah. And once again, we see here, um, Bok Choi just kind of has a hard time taking the stock. Just can't get enough damage. Throws the key at nothing. That was a, that was a bit of a mistake. There's a back air. There's, and finally yeah, gets the stock. It. 149%. Starting to look like me against most players. <laughs> Gotta get him to two, three hundred percent before you can kill yeah. him. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's um the hard thing with Pac-Man is like, especially on a floaty character. Oh, he went for it. Oh, fuck his head. All right, so Bok Choi running it back a little. Oh yikes, this is scary. Like I said, there's Being that, that Jigglypuff stall. That nair. Just able to wait for Bok Choi to try and get back up. Will he go for an edge guard? He kind of does. Bok Choi trying there. to make a comeback. Yeah, he's, he's getting the percent. Um, now he just needs like a, a strong smash attack or, or some sort of kill setup to take this game. Okay. Playing a little more defensive. Taking his time. Oh, that could be it though. Not enough. Wow. And the stage just spike barely, for the win. Just barely takes it. Actually was able to come back. Uh, and, and squeeze. Squeeze that game out. Um. That was a close one. I really surprising. thought Stacked had him. It looked like he did, but then Bok Choi just, just slowly ticked away at him and then uh, ended up getting the, the sort of lucky stage spike there at the end. Yep. Uh, and Puff. But no character switch. Um, and Let's see where they end up going. Maybe Lilat. Lilat, that's an interesting okay. pick. Going for the... Uh, off-stage shenanigans on this one, I'm guessing. I do like Lilat as Pac- Well, I don't know if I like Lilat as Pac-Man. I know Cam doesn't- or Bok Choi doesn't like Lilat as Pac-Man. Um, but I think the- 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 the angled uh, sides make for interesting and different uh, fruit mechanics. So yes. you can sort of play around with those. Especially with characters that have a bad recovery to begin with. Yeah. Or a difficult recovery. But Jigglypuff is not one. Uh, you don't see Bok Choi doing a lot of uh, edge guarding. Um, and if you do, it's just him going out there for a back air or something. So Bok Choi actually up in percent here, just by a little. There he goes with that trampoline again. He likes to leave that behind just in case. Easy recovery for Bok Choi, but he's off the ledge oh, now. Oh, doesn't get that. Doesn't get the uh, the, the air dodge read. I just can't find the kill. Either of them, really. I'm um, looking for it. The next Both big hit should do it. Floaty characters, they're at kill percent. Just need to land something. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah. I mean, um. Violet, like, tilting. That. Ooh. Okay. So, Dash Attack coming to take that stock. Yeah, as Lilat tilts, that can cause your Galaga to, to to run into the stage and you can pick it up, which 
you know, probably build the blessing in the first place. Well, and there's wow. the kill with the apple. Well played. He's gonna get pineapple underneath up by the, the floating stage. Or yeah. Like Cherries. Bok Choi really giving an effort here. Oh. If he was on flat ground, that could have been it. Well, he's probably not at high enough percent though. Bok Choy does have a, a, a pretty um, significant percent lead. And he's keeping up the pressure. Oh, watch out. <laughs> that melon just barely going over the head of, of Stack. Is that a melon or a lime? I thought it was a melon, but now that you said lime, I think it's I think a lime. But I have no clue. Oh, uh -oh. no! <gasps> oh, wow! Stacked able to oh, just... the clutch edge guard. Knock him all the way off the side that of the stage. That was rush. Bok Choy very unhappy with that. Short Such a close air. match.